Massachusetts ditch the MCAS test as a graduation requirement. Voters will decide in November. Hi, I'm Emily Volz. And hello once again, everyone. I'm Dan Jank. This is a big, hot topic. NBC 10's Kennedy Buck breaks down the debates as we hear from those on both sides of this question. Since 1993, public school students in Massachusetts have been required to pass the MCAS exam in order to receive their high school diploma. Now that single statewide standard for graduation uh, is really the most meaningful and sole requirement that helps us determine whether or not a student is ready to go forward. But in November, this tradition could end. Voters will have a ballot question to decide if the MCAS exam should be eliminated as a requirement for graduation. Their education has been reduced to the skills of a test. Students are able to demonstrate uh, knowledge and competency without high stakes. Advocates like the Massachusetts Teachers Association say that this exam puts pressure and stress on students, but others disagree. We really want to make sure that every student in Massachusetts is ready for that next big step in their life. MCAS is one of the things that allows us to have that guarantee of quality, of, of, of high standard. It's now up to voters to say yes or no. This is removing the high stakes but not the high standards. Instead of throwing out a system that has worked for tens, hundreds of thousands of kids, we really should try to work to make sure that every student can cross that finish line. The November ballot question would keep the MCAS, but passing the test would no longer be required to earn a high school diploma. Reporting Kennedy Buck, NBC 10 News.